Hi, I'm Rich Belfus. I'm president and CEO of the International Crane Foundation. Uh, the International Crane Foundation is a nonprofit organization dedicated to saving cranes and the places they need, the ecosystems, the watersheds, the flyways that sustain them. But I love the work of the International Crane Foundation. I think especially in these times, you know, cranes stand for international cooperation and goodwill. So important, we work across lots of different countries and communities. Uh, cranes really require us to solve all kinds of conservation problems that are the challenges everybody's facing, like dealing with climate change and loss of wetlands, loss of grasslands, illegal trade. You know, so many conservation problems out there uh, have a huge effect on cranes as an endangered family of birds. And so uh, they force us to be innovative and uh, do exciting and uh, sort of cutting edge work all the time, which I really value. <laughs> well, we chose the conservation standards for the International Crane Foundation because we really thought that it would help us think strategically about the work that we do around the world. And I wanted to be allied with other conservation organizations that have committed to the standards and work together to use them and improve them. I think increasingly they're very important to donors to see our approach using the standards, donors are getting uh, much more focused on real outcomes instead of just activities, and I think that's really important. This is a system that you need to invest in and put the time into using it well, and it can really help you better hone your mission, help you hone the outcomes that you really want to achieve as an organization. And I think, you know, this is saying about starting with the end in mind, it really helps us start at that end point, and rather than fitting what we're doing today and sort of adapting what we're doing today to get to some outcome. We start with the outcome we want and we work back and say, are we doing today what we need to be doing? And I think conservation science can really help us do that better. So I think it's worth, worth the investment.